Hey guys, welcome to TCT and the Crazy Troll Nation of YouTube. The crazy just because I am sometimes a troll because I consider myself a troll when I put on face paint. A cute troll, but a troll nonetheless. If you've been here before, welcome back. If this is your first time, thank you for being here. This is just a really quick update. I know I'm talking really fast. I just did a video, so I'm just trying to knock them out. So this is an update on my mother. Um, the video I did a while ago that she had COVID. She is in a nursing home. She has dementia. She's been there almost two and a half years now, I think. Um, her, she was tested twice since she tested positive. They retested everyone in the facility, all the patients, all the staff, and she tested negative. And so they were going to retest everybody again to make sure like it wasn't a false negative or, you know, other people have false positives or whatever. And so now her status is considered resolved. And the floor she was on was known as the COVID floor because that's where they were putting well, that's where the, the patients who had COVID just happened to be. And the ones who were on the first floor, they moved them up to the second floor, yada, 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 yada. But now it's kind of reversed. A lot of the ones that were positive are now negative or resolved, as their file says. And a lot of the ones who were negative are now positives. And so, and even a lot of staff members are now positive for COVID. So even though I am happy, she was symptomatic through the entire thing, which was great. Um, but I... I'm still not sure how to feel like I'm happy she her case is resolved which means that she's negative for COVID but I don't know there's so many questions we still don't know can a person catch COVID twice if COVID mutates which coronavirus that's here now is a mutation of the SARS from years ago so if it mutates again can they catch that or even if it doesn't mutate can they catch the same one they just had and if so, COVID will just continue to cycle through the facility. So I'm just, and these are questions even medical people are still saying that they don't know yet. And also people are saying, oh, I just hope I get it. And then I'll develop antibodies against it. Well, if you, my question is, if you develop antibodies against the COVID that you caught, is that going to, are those antibodies going to prevent you from catching a different strain of COVID? And another question I have is, if you do develop antibodies for it, and if you cannot catch it again, can you still be a carrier? Meaning, you can still be contagious to other people. You know what I mean? So it's... But again, I am really glad that she's safe and that she's healthy and her case is resolved as far as COVID. But just those other questions, it's just still like, hmm because not knowing the answers to those questions in my mind, I'm like, okay, when they do open up the nursing home, am I gonna feel comfortable taking her around family in case she is a carrier? And for sure, I wouldn't wanna take her to visit her mom, my grandmother, who's 94, because of course we don't want her to catch COVID or any type of cold flu illness or whatever. So I, I'm just waiting on answers like everybody else, but so I just wanted to give an update on that because that video is still up and every now and then somebody will message me, how is she? And you know, this must be tough. And so I just wanted to put it out here that she is well. And um, her COVID case is considered resolved in her chart. So she's negative right now and hopefully will remain so and will not be a carrier. <laughs> but time will tell what the medical research brings up, which I don't think they'll have answers anytime soon because there's a lot of testing that needs to be done and it's still only been a short time frame um, since this pandemic has started. So I think we're far away off from knowing those answers to those questions that I have. So that's it for this video. Thank you guys for watching. I appreciate your concern um, and you will see me in the next video. Bye.